That's what y'all call D. Huh? If you are a returning subscriber, what's good, eh? Hey? What's poppin'? What's good, eh? Hey? What's poppin'? What's good, eh? Hey? What's poppin'? Welcome back. How y'all doing? Okay. Um, so yeah, I know I've been missing. Like I said, I had some stuff dealing with and whatnot. My hair is wet because I washed it. So yeah. But um, as you can see by the title of today's video, I will be answering some deep, deep questions. Um, I posted a question thing on Instagram and just had you guys ask me um, some deep questions. So we're going to see what them questions is about. Before we get into the video, don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe. Tell him I'm going to tell Angie, but tell him I'm going to tell that that your girl Kit is back on the scene. Okay, and today is just day one of the week long marathon. And then we go back into us, into the regular schedule Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Saturdays. Okay, so let's get right into it. Alright, so let's get right into it. The first question is, oh, okay. <laughs> Are you okay mentally? Hmm. Now I am. Actually, I can say now I am okay mentally. Um, so yeah, but thanks for asking though. Uh, when are you gonna stop playing and be mine? Huh? Never? Never? <laughs> uh, the next. I don't know. That's what y'all call D. That ain't D. <sighs> y'all are petty. But, um, the next question is If you had the option to know the dates and circumstances of your death, would you? No. Absolutely not. I don't want to know. Reason being, I'm gonna start going crazy. I'm not going nowhere I'm at. I'm gonna just, I'm gonna just, my anxiety level is gonna go sky high because I'm gonna be panicking and all that because, okay, you know, let's say it's gonna be tomorrow. What am I gonna do? It ain't gonna be okay for me. That's all I know. It's not gonna be okay for me. So, no, I don't wanna know. How do you recharge? To be honest, just sleep. That is really, and meditate. Meditate and sleep is how I actually recharge. And trust me, I may need to recharge sometime soon. But yeah. Next question. Why did you decide to do what you are doing now in your life? Um, Something I always wanted to do, and I felt like, better now than later why not um i was also tired of school so i was like i might as well just do it now and guess what i'm back in school because i was just tired of army 
but yeah what would you like to change about your family how knows them be seriously like <laughs> I guess I don't have nothing else to say like what I want to change about my family. They just nosy. I don't know, mind y'all business. Go be on y'all way. What are you addicted to? Like anything in life? I mean, no, you could say sleep because I love to sleep. So I guess I'm addicted to sleeping. I don't know what else to say to, um, I don't know. I ain't gonna even ask you. I don't know what I'm addicted to. Besides sleep, um, in terms of many have food, I'm addicted to food. Next question. What milestones are you working towards right now in your personal and professional life? Woo! Uh, professional life, I am actually trying to reclass I just changed my job and actually go to JAG, which is legal, and that actually ties into my um, personal life. It's finishing my degree so I could basically uh, reclass. So that's one milestone of each. I have multiple milestones. Um, so yeah, well, that's one milestone of each is finishing school and reclass into what I really want to do. Do you like spicy foods? No, I don't like spicy foods. I love them. There's a difference. Next question. Do you believe in love at first sight? And if the stars align. <laughs> um, I mean, yeah and no at the same time. I mean, I guess it just depends on who it is. Me personally, eh, I don't know. My love at first sight is for food. You know, when I see a nice plate of food, boom, that's love right there, okay, period. Uh, next question, do you believe a person deserves second chances? It depends on the situation, it depends on the circumstances. I would say a person deserves second chances, case by case scenarios. Cause it's not everybody deserves second chances. Some people actually do. Cause it's like minor, or it's like something that you can overcome. If it's something that you can't overcome, then why are you gonna give that person a, a second chance? It's just gonna be a constant reminder. You never gonna move on if you're that type of person to like pull things in. So I guess case by case uh, situations. Um, I guess. Oh, yeah. But pause. I just gotta pull up this song. Y'all know I gotta pull it up every time. question do you believe in infant baptism yes I do next do you believe in divorce it depends on the circumstances it's a case-by-case -case scenario so yes and no. yes I believe in divorce because eh, I mean everything no it don't always have to work so yeah I believe in divorce if it's supposed to happen it will happen are you single or taken? Why don't you mind your business? Huh? 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 What are your plans? What are your future plans? To be successful in this platform and to be successful in life in general, to be honest. But, um, you know, my business to flourish to keep flourishing actually always flourishing same perseverance um <laughs> and yeah to prosper in this you know what I'm if you know what I'm saying you understand you understand what I'm saying you know what I mean you know I look so good in this camp <laughs> 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 
mean. But anyway, next question. How did you kick your business off? Man, to be honest, I just went for it. Like, I was doing couple stuff some time ago, and then I was like, I'm good at this. I could perfect myself, you know? I could go places if I just keep going at it and going at it and going. And I was like, one day I decided, I was like, you know what? I'm just going to make it official. I was brainstorming ideas. And not only that, it's like, I always think about, oh, me and this person, let's do this together. Let's do, let's make this business. Let's do this business. And I was like, it never worked out. And then I was like, you are not a person that's supposed to work with somebody like that. You are supposed to be independent. And I was like, you know what? Boom. I'm just going to start my business and call it a day. I just bought everything from, you know, little by little and here I am today. What are your plans for YouTube? <sighs> uh, in terms of, I mean, short term, it's just to keep, well, I mean long term actually, just to keep growing and building relationships with people, you know, having a good community where, you know, you could just talk about pretty much anything so yeah that's pretty much my plan do you really like being in the army yes i'm not even gonna lie to you i actually do i mean it has its days like i've said numerous times before it has its days where you just don't want to be here it's just like any other job but i actually do love what i do um, I mean, the army have stupid rules, regulations, just like anything else, anywhere else that you may think, you know. So, you just gotta go by it. But it has its days, but I, at the end of the day, I still do um, like what I do in the army. What inspires you the most? Just seeing how far that I've come. Whether personally, professionally, mentally, physically, spiritually, all of, all of the above. Just how far I've come and how much I've grown. Are you living a meaningful life? Yeah, I would say. Yeah, I would say I'm living a meaningful life. What's something that's overwhelmed you? How have your priorities changed over time? Uh, how have priorities changed over time? Um, I've just had more to do in terms of wanting to expand, so you know, stuff shift and that type of stuff. So, um just me wanting to expand in what I do has shifted certain things, um, taking responsibility of certain things. So, yeah. And the last question, what are you most proud of? How strong I am. Because, man oh man, I've been on a rough road. And it's just me overcoming every hurdle that I have ever get encountered with. And that is what I'm most proud of. And that's all the questions. I want to say thank you to everybody who asked me a question, participated in this, and whatnot. I really appreciate y'all. And I appreciate all of you who came back. Who been just holding it down, holding the boy down, you know what I'm saying? Um, I really appreciate all y'all. That's the end of the video. Um, also, this flyer right here is basically just the start of the topics for the week starting from today 
um, you know, this set, this one here with the questions, and there's gonna be military related, life related, makeup related, cultural related, and food related. I'm trying to get all the videos up by 9 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. So, um, yeah. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Tell him I'm telling you, tell you, tell you that your girl King is back. I and I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace.